Hey, I'm Lazy Video Guy. Today I'm being a little bit more lazy than usual and just doing it handheld because I can't really be able to set the tripod. Um, we're going to be looking at high ISO today. Um, we're going to look at the F log at up to 12,800, I believe it is, and the you know the Eterna profile as well. Again, 12,800, and we're going to see what it looks like. We're going to go up incrementally uh, and try and compare the two. Recording DCI 4K, 25p, 400 megabits per second, uh, and that's again the all intro compression. So we're starting off with F-Log at 640 ISO, and then we're going to keep punching in 250% like so, and then we're going to chuck the LUT on as well, so you can see what that looks like. So obviously those shadows are going to come down quite a lot. That 1000 ISO looks relatively nice. Um, again, it's, it's pretty, pretty similar to the 640. I've used f-stop and a, I've got a, a, a TIFF in MD as well that I'm using to compensate for light when I'm pumping up the ISO. A 1600 ISO, yep, yeah, looks pretty good. I'd be happy to shoot with that. Thirty two hundred ISO, you can see it does get a bit noisier, but once that light is on, as you can see, it crushes most of that noise away. And that top right portion of the frame when we crop in looks nice, as well as the mid-tones on that curtain there. Now, we don't seem to be losing much in the way of colour. 6400 you're seeing a lot more noise. Now, I am on a 250% crop in, in the 4K mode, so, so 6400 is probably as high as I would be willing to go. And it doesn't look too bad, but yeah, it is a little bit noisy. The colours though, again, it's, it's keeping them relatively well, especially on those highlight areas. Uh, 12800. Now, th obviously, this is going to be a bit grubby. Yeah, it's it's really not that nice at all. It's very noisy. The highlights are fine, but yeah, the, the mid tones and the low mid tones are pretty pretty disgusting. We're, st we're starting the Eterna at 640 as well, just so it's a relatively fair test. Uh, I didn't expose this quite as well. Um, this is on the default settings and in terms of dynamic range as well. 640 looks beautiful. Nothing wrong with it. 1600 again, cropping in looks perfect. I'd happily use that, even the really dark shadows are nice. Uh, I've exposed this 3200 shot a little bit higher, uh, just to be a bit more generous on the shadows. Doesn't look too bad, a little bit noisy, but yeah, it's workable. 6400, I should have probably compensated a little bit more, uh, but you can still see those shadows, they are a lot noisier, it's similar to the F-Log. A little bit less noisy than the F-Log I think, but usable, probably as high as I'd go, wouldn't go much higher than this. The 12800 is just as you'd expect, pretty disgusting, but it's nicer than the F-Log, so if you were torn between a Turner and F-Log, I'd probably go for the Turner for low light, but I guess that was always going to be the case. Sweet, that was just a quick one, uh, but I hope it's vaguely useful. Um, cheers, thanks for watching. Uh, hopefully I'll have some time to do some more soon. Cheers.